What is up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Erica if you are new here and I love doing active wear reviews, swimwear reviews, and today I'm so, so excited because I'm actually doing a clothing haul with Zaffle. Now Zaffle did reach out to me and let me just say I am so excited about this video. They did offer to send me these pieces that will absolutely not change my views and opinions. I will still be giving you my honest thoughts and trying everything on for you. So if you're interested in my little winter inspired Zaffle haul, make sure to settle in, grab a snack, subscribe, and let's get into it. Okay, so I feel like I do have to preface this video by saying that about four or five years ago, I used to watch this one girl on YouTube all the time. She was a fashion YouTuber and I just loved her style. And she always did Zaffle hauls and reviews. And I just remember thinking, wow, it would be so incredible to get to work with a brand in that way where you get to go on their site, pick out a few items that you like, and then do a review and a try on and share different styling tips and stuff. And I just can't believe that I'm standing here today filming one of those videos for you guys. I, it's just, it's crazy to me. Every day I just wake up and I'm so grateful for getting to do this part-time. You know, I would love to be a full-time content creator, but I'm just so grateful for the fact that I can do it part-time for you guys and I'm finally starting to get brand deals and brand sponsorships for these kinds of videos because it just helps me create more content for you and I just really love it. I'm really passionate about it. So without further ado, let's do a Zaffle try on haul and review. I was not sure guys if this stuff would work for me just because I always kind of put Zaffle in my mind as like this brand that would be way too small for me and I just I don't have the biggest size range I would love to see them expand that size range but right now it does go from extra small to extra large and I'm definitely more on the large side of things so I just wasn't sure if any of these pieces would work for me and I've got to say I'm pleasantly surprised so let's get right into it I have a variety of things all of these were inspired by the winter and kind of layering I don't know the names of all of these off the top of my head but I have linked everything down below and I also have a code with Zaffle, if you want to get 22% off your order, you can use the code 22ERIKA, E-R-I-K-A, and you can get 22% off your entire order. Now, without further ado, let's get into the pieces. Starting off, I got this really cute faux leather dress. It's like a rouged dress, and honestly, it doesn't look like much on the hanger here, but guys, this is so, so cute. I'm going to put in a couple different clips of how I styled this. I styled it multiple different ways, and I was really inspired to just use something that has this kind of leathery texture to layer on top of, wear different shoes. I really was able to dress this up as like a going out dress, but also wear it in a more casual way and get a little bit more everyday wear out of it. So this is so cute. This in a size large I believe everything I got in today's haul I got yeah this is a size large um, I will also have all my measurements down below I'm pretty sure I got everything from this haul in a size large today so this fits me like a glove it's super stretchy so like this is not one of those dresses that you'll put on and you'll feel really constricted like I could fall on do a squat in it because it really really stretches with you um it also since it has that fake leather it is like really warm like after i took it off i was like sweating and all i was doing was changing my outfit so like this is super warm great great versatile piece the one complaint i had about this is i took it out of the bag and the smell was to the point of being like unbearable. It was so bad. It had a really, really strong odor. After I let it just kind of air out a little bit, 
I don't smell it at all anymore, but like taking it out of the bag, I was like, whoa. This dress does come in black and brown. I think the brown would be really cute, but I just thought the black would just be more versatile with things that I currently have. So really, really cute piece. I have a size large and it fits so so nicely the rouging actually is super flattering and it's a body dress, but it doesn't make you feel like you're like doesn't make you feel uncomfortable it actually made me feel really confident because of the rouging details so i love this dress i love 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 it i'm gonna get a lot of use out of it to go with the dress got this adorable little black and white cardigan this is also a size large you have buttons here and it is like a zebra print or like a swirl kind of print on the one side and then checkered on the other. Cardigans are super in right now, so I thought this would be really cute to pair with this dress, which I have a picture I will show you guys. And I also just thought this would be cute to throw on like a black pair of jeans and boots, a white top, and then just throw this on top and it would just look really cute. I love this. This fits me perfectly. It's not like too too cropped where I would never wear it. It has just kind of that typical stretchy sweater feel and it's just a really cute little unique piece. So I love that it has the two tones. It just makes it really fun. So I love this and the back is also split down the middle between the two prints. Moving on to another black and white piece that I got. I picked up this houndstooth skirt and I got this in a size large. That was the biggest size and I knew that because it has the buttons I would have a little bit of an issue with it fitting me. I do have wide hips, I do carry all my weight in my lower stomach and I do have a little bit of a butt so I knew that this would be 50-50 on fitting me or not. What I actually did is these buttons here are functional and I buttoned the top button and then left this to kind of flare out. You'll see it in the picture and the try on. But I found that if I wore like black biker shorts underneath or a long sleeve bodysuit, which I'm wearing in the video, that it's not that big of a deal. I think it'd be really cool to layer a hoodie over top of it. And I just think the layering effect in general will be cool. So since I did have it, you know, only button on the top. It does look a little bit weird. Like I have to adjust it perfectly on my leg and keep it open. But I think it is a really cute look. I do wish there wasn't a button there, but like if I did button it all the way, it just looks a little tight. So I would say that this runs a little bit small just because this is a large, but like the quality of it is really nice. Like it is a thick material and I really do like how it looks on. I'm curious like how much use I'll be able to get out of it just because I have to wear it in such a specific way, but it is really cute and it's very wintry and I'm excited to dress it up. I actually think it would look cute with this hoodie, my worthy hoodie. Like that would be a cute little outfit with some black boots. To go with my little houndstooth outfit, I picked up the most adorable little houndstooth purse. You guys, this is like a mini purse so cute i also just thought like this would be cute with a black hoodie and just black leggings like so in style on trend you definitely can only fit a little wallet in here like this is not holding a phone or anything like that but it's just a really cute little statement bag that i think could go with a lot of different outfits the tiny micro purse is definitely another trend going on right now so i love this i will say like the chains aren't like the highest quality but it is really cute and i just love it it's so adorable okay let's talk about this brown ruched dress so it looks not great on the hanger it's like a one shoulder dress bodycon dress i'm assuming i got this in a size large yep yeah, size large and this dress is a beautiful chocolatey brown taupe color it's not like super brown it's more of like a 
can. Oh, it's so beautiful in person. The first time I tried this on, I could not figure out how to get it on. And I just couldn't figure out how to get the strap to go on the one shoulder. I don't know why, it was just like not working. So then, kind of just chalked it up to being like a miss. I was like, okay, this dress looks really ridiculous on me. Then I pulled up the website and I looked at how the dress was sitting on the model and I just kind of like shimmied it around and got it into where it's supposed to be and you guys it's so freaking flattering and cute. The rouging of this dress makes it really flattering. The back this is all rouged in the back so this just hugs your glutes really nicely and the one thing I'll say is like the way that the fabric sits across your one shoulder like it definitely could slide around I felt like it wasn't that secure in the top part so I would definitely wear a strapless bra with this dress or use like sticky tape to make sure it sticks like here i could see it like sliding around in the future but oh my gosh it's so so pretty on i can't wait to wear this to like a wedding or something it's really cute it's very modest it's not too short it's the perfect length i really really love this so i have this in a size large and it's super super flattering super stretchy and comfortable and guys this is on sale i think for like $19 so cheap so affordable love it and the quality is actually really good so I love this so cute definitely one of my favorite items that I got from this little haul okay next up oh, we have this beautiful white fuzzy shacket now these are super popular for just throwing over some like leggings and a sports bra and like just dressing up like your outfit a little bit. I feel like you can use this to put together any outfit for like brunch or like lunch or something. You could definitely layer this over a hoodie. I got this in a size large and it's the perfect oversized fit on me. I will say like the inside is not going to be fleece material it is just the sherpa material on the outside so i would say you would want to layer this or this is a great transition piece from like winter to spring because it's not like super super warm you won't be like hot in it but it definitely will be nice to add another layer on top of what you're already wearing so another feature of this that i really liked is the sides are split here so it just sits really nicely on your body and it's really flattering and really cute I threw it on over biker shorts and like a zip up and it was really cute I feel like there's just a lot of different ways you can wear this and as like a last piece to just bring your outfit together so this is really cute I would say this is definitely gonna be something that is you get what you pay for. This isn't the most high quality Sherpa that I've ever bought in my life, but this is way nicer than I was expecting and it's really, really soft and cozy. So I love this. I can't wait to wear this over my active wear to dress it up a little bit. Next up, let's talk about, I think, okay, I love so much of this haul, but I think this might be my favorite piece and I really was not sure if I was gonna like it. This is the cutest little corduroy Sherpa jacket ever, ever. Oh my gosh, I love this. So it is going to be just like a lighter jacket, definitely something you can wear transitioning winter to spring and also from fall to winter, like definitely a fall piece. Like I think you could wear this honestly all year round because it's not super thick or anything. The inside is definitely like just kind of thin but the outside is the Sherpa material and it's not super hot or warm or anything but it just has that aesthetic of like looking like a nice warm jacket and honestly I think this jacket looks higher quality than it is but it was super affordable and that's what's like really important in my opinion um, is spending less money but looking really put together and elevated so I think this is an amazing jacket super cute super unique i loved this with just like a white bodysuit and then i paired it with high-waisted like loose fitting jeans so so cute hair pulled back with some earrings 
Oh my gosh, I love this jacket. It's so cute. I think it looks best paired with jeans and just like a plain top underneath. But I love this jacket so, so much. So, so much. It is so freaking cute. And I got this one in a size large. And this is perfect. The one thing I would say is the buttons, they just make a lot of noise because they're kind of like loosely on there. But it doesn't really bother me because the jacket itself is so freaking cute. Last little item that I picked up was this, this little set of chained necklaces. Three-tiered chain necklace situation. You have like a thin one. Then you have a thicker choker. I don't have anything like this that are just plain. So I just saw them for like $8 and was like, oh, this would be perfect because you actually get three. And I didn't know this, but they're actually separated. So sometimes when you buy these kinds of like tiered necklaces, they'll be combined into one necklace that you have to wear all three, but these are actually separate. So I can wear it this one or vice versa so super cute layering look this was just like a last minute edition that i picked up and i actually really like these they're exactly the quality you would expect for the price point but they are really cute and i like that you can wear them separately okay guys that wraps up my very first zaffle try on haul and review i am so impressed with this stuff all oh, their sizing is limited i hope that they expand that in the future for being someone who has always strayed away from zaffle i because i was worried that nothing would fit me right i'm very very pleasantly surprised i think zaffle would be great to shop for trends or you know some things that may not always be in style just because it's the perfect price point to try out different trends and see if it works for you without you know investing a lot into a piece but i am very very shocked at how well everything fits me and how much i like all of it so cute i can't wait to wear everything and if you guys have any questions about zaffle or any of the pieces that I showed here today, make sure to drop a comment down below. Let me know if you liked this video. I know I did. I'm so honored and grateful that Zaffel reached out to me to try these pieces. I am excited to continue to shop with them in the future. And that is it for my little try on haul and review. Make sure to follow me on Instagram if you are not already at Erica X Timmons. Follow me on TikTok at Erica X Timmons and I will see you guys in my next video.